Hey, Ragelings, and welcome back to Dimension 2 Let's Play. We found the sledgehammer, we've opened up a couple of new areas, and we've squished some bugs. And now, we're gonna grab some health and follow the blood trail to this decapitated corpse, which is obviously not where I'm supposed to be going. Alright. And I apparently can't break boxes. Can knock down entire planks of wood, but can't break a box. You shut up. I am talking here. Holy crap, what the hell? Skipped a few frames of animation there. God damn it. This is kind of buggy. <laughs> Newt clipping. P.E.L.F. A state-run psychiatric hospital has been shut down just weeks after a Detroit news station exposed shocking living conditions for many of its patients. Undercover reporter Carlos Brewer worked as an orderly at the hospital for three months, all the while secretly filming incidents of neglect and abuse at the hands of other staff members. Many of the allegations of cruelty center on the failure to update the building, formerly a state prison, to provide adequate care. Getting the distinct impression they're kind of talking about this place. I guess this uh, PELF was renamed to Break On. Because that would make sense as this place looks like a prison still. And now we descend even further into madness. Uh, looks like a save station. Sweet! I prefer the save stations to actually having to use health items because obviously it restores health. And I'd rather have health items for more important things like boss fights. So I try to hold on to them as best as I can. Oh, shit. Do you even have the slightest idea where you're going with him? Um, yes, like Wheatley. In a maze, for its cheese. I like cheese. But guess what, is it Gouda? The cheese is all gone. No! Give me back my Gouda! That's not Gouda! Obvious joke. Okay, this part sucks. Because, ah, oh, fuck, there it is. I can't let that fucker touch me or I get transported into a little arena and then have to kill a bunch of monsters to escape. This section is very fucking annoying and I think there's at least two of them. Okay, come on. Gotta lure this faggot out here. God damn it, go! Ah, okay. Alright, it's not that hard to outrun them, but damn it, is this part annoying. Run, 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 run. Oh, shit. Um, how do I get past him? He's right in my path. How's that fair? Shit, let's go back. Maybe I gotta lure them all into the same spot. Damn it. What am I supposed to do here? Doesn't help that this flashlight sucks. And you can't kill these fuckers either, so... I'm kind of stuck here. Trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do. Come on. Any day now. God damn. Could have made the designs more creepy, to be honest. Maybe these guys left their spot. Oh shit, there's two of them! God damn! All right, well, I'll just lure them over this way. Ah, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Ugh. All right, let's try this again. Hoi-ka-pow! Bang your head! Gonna smash your skull in with this hammer! Yeah! Beautiful tile balls. Ugh, hate this section so much. Fuck you. This is really all there is to these parts. That's what makes it so annoying. Is there's nothing like, nothing extra going on. Just, hey, they're gonna throw a couple monsters at you, and like it should have some kind of effect on the actual player. And would make it even more like this is more of a nuisance than it is terrifying. 
All right, let's try this again. Oh, fuck, I waited too long. God damn it. Eh, he's not going away. Shit. Fuck. Damn it. All right. So it looks like I'm going to have to run back in. There's no way out of this. I'm going to have to go through that fucking thing again. These guys are such shit. This section's crap. Fuck. All right. Take me away. Calgon. Killy, killy, killy. You know what? Fuck this. We're skipping past this shit. Alright, so obviously I survived. No more of that bullshit. This time, all business. I am not going through that crap again. Alright. Come on. Follow me. Oop. Come on. Come on. God damn it, the AI pathing is terrible in this. Okay. So we've bypassed the first jackass. Apparently there's two jackasses over here. Call them jackasses. That's right, jackasses. It's funnier that way. Fucking damn. Hate this section so much. Like I said, there's... There's this section and there's another one later on. And they're both fucking terribly done. Alright. So I gotta figure out where this next one is. Oh, he's right there! Shit! Run! Ugh. Oh, crap. Alright, I'm not sh I think I gotta go straight across. Wait, no, I'm supposed to go in there. No, no! We're back again! Go, 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 go! Now I remember what I'm supposed to do. God damn it. I forgot about this part. There's a uh, path to the north that I'm supposed to actually go to. <laughs> Fucking game tricked me. Go, 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 go. Gotta run as fast as possible. Oh, shit! Oh, this is so painful for my knees. Oh, God damn it, I hate those sections with a passion. I think we're done with that. Yes, we, we've made it through. Thank fucking God. So ridiculous. It's over here. Uh, lock with a dagger symbol. We need a special key to get in there. Uh, have I mentioned that I hate that fucking section? I'm not trying to. I will cut all of you. Alright, what's over here? Uh, this store's got some weird stuff all over it. The heat from my hands is making them fall backwards. Alright. Oh, I love holding this hammer. Oh, yes. Alright. I think I fight a couple monsters in this tunnel. I think this is actually the tunnel that that note was talking about. Can I break this down? Nope. Just a texture wall. Hello! I was getting kind of lonely down here. I miss the original designs. The faces were way creepier. They had like an open mouth with really jagged teeth and they're all kinds of fucked up, and these ones are kind of plain looking, to be honest. Ah, more of them. Figure with these guys, I'll just use the sledge, because it's so much easier to take them out. 
If you look closely within the chest cavity, you can actually see their heart beating. And I could swear that that's their... At least in the uh, DS version, it was a weak point, and if you hit that, you could kill them a little quicker. Oh, fuck. Go away. Ah, boosh. Come on. Ah. Ah, shit. Damn it. Crap. Come on. Boom. Got him. I think I'm getting better with this thing. The other downside to this game is that it's very linear, as you can see. It's just kind of leading you through a corridor and, uh... I hate, I hate games like this that do that because it feels just kind of like a haunted house ride. Like there was a section in um, Silent Hill Downpour where it literally was a haunted house ride. You're in like a cage and it just took you past some slightly spooky scenes. Chapter 2. It's spreading. My herpes has taken hold of the town. Oh good. We've escaped. And a postcard. What's it say? It's spreading like a cancer. Hurry! William. Alright. Where are we heading to? I believe we, um, believe we go into town now. What's... What, what the fuck is that? I don't remember this. Ah! Holy shit! Can I hurt him? Die! Shit! Frosty the Snow Ghost needs to go the fuck away! Oh, god damn it! I don't think I can hurt this guy. Shit! Um, run! Best option! Yeah, no, I think it's too ethereal. I think I gotta go this way. Yeah, I gotta go this way. That's a new one on me. I definitely don't remember that guy. Weird. Ah, oh, man. Reloading. Got my sledgehammer hammer. Wendigo Witch Legend. It is said that her daughter's murder was the catalyst. After devouring the flesh of another person, she was transformed into a Wendigo witch. She is very powerful, but constantly starving, roaming the plains, lusting for more human flesh. More flesh is good for the witch. Found some ammos. And a nice save spot to kind of stop that. Ooh, we got another note. Let's see what this one says. William, my love, you have finally returned for me. My dear William, I have missed you desperately. Go south to the docks. It is my favorite place. I will see you there. Please hurry. Love, Elizabeth. Kisses and hugs. Lots of kisses and hugs. All right. I'm guessing Elizabeth is William's wife. And uh, I think we're going to stop here. <sighs> Definitely plenty of time spent almost dying. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, don't forget to comment, subscribe, and as always, share with your friends to help spread the Rageling Swarm. Don't forget to check out Dimension 2 on Steam, as well as the DS versions of the first and second games. Thank you for watching.